is Bitcoin supply on cryptocurrency exchanges will dry up in nine months. Thanks to the 50% supply issuance reduction of this week's upcoming Bitcoin halving. And provided that the inflows from the United States Bitcoin exchange traded funds ETFs continue, Bitcoin's post halving supply dynamic will see exchange reserves run out of Bitcoin according to an April 15 report by BitIt. 16 uh, Bitcoin reserves on centralized exchanges fell to a near three year low of 1.94 million BTC on April 16th, according to CryptoQuant data. Uh, the report comes amid a wider market slump that saw Bitcoin fall over 10% during the past week to $62,924 as of 1.36 p.m. UTC, according to CoinMarketCap. Uh, Bybit, the world's third largest exchange, expects Bitcoin prices to start recovering from the current correction, according to the report. A weekly inflows into the spot. Uh, Bitcoin ETFs have been slowing down since March last week, saw over $199 million worth of net inflows into the ETFs, down from $2.58, 90 billion in the week, beginning March 11th. According to Dean, you can make a... F and despite the recent slump, the Bitcoin ETFs amassed over 841,000 BTC, worth $52.9 billion, with over $12.7 billion net flows since launch. According to Dune, uh, Bitcoin investor allocation has risen since last September. Uh, institutions are allocating an average of 40% of total assets to BTC, while retail investors average a Bitcoin allocation of 24%, according to Bybit's asset allocation report from February 24th. Uh, Bybit noted that both crypto native firms and traditional institutions are gaining increasing exposure to Bitcoin via ETFs or proxy stocks such as MicroStrategy. The exchange expects more institutions to stop the cycles and follow suit.